Grey Sky, an excerpt from Skirting the Edge. Without you near, the sky is grey and dull. The birds have lost their song. The colours dim, the flowers fade away. The joy of summer days have passed far beyond, and the whispers sweet nothings have flowed into dusk. And nights of which we prayed have left us broken and scarred. For the angels have fallen, the harps are tuneless, their wings tumble down and lie bare before me. The life in me is drained and stuck in a rut. The winter chill has frozen up the awnings, like the parched tongue to a proverbial pole, and nothing I say will change it. I sit and I stare, I wait around the corner for the chance that you will come again someday, and I'll hear your voice, like a kite flowing on a westerly wind, like hum that sounds through the morning mist, like the caress of a hand through hair, or a soothing bath, or all rubbed up for a day such as this, the winter chill, cold as ice, and still as dawn. When you pass my way, I heard your voice, and the lights shine on one last time before I go. This isn't my scene. It is not my life. You're not beside me anymore. We're on different paths. The tangents are bare, parallel, ever-changing, always straying, never near. But with the winds we call, I hear your voice once more, and its caress, its soothing touch, the warmth with which it brings, will follow me always into the dark night before me. I'll keep it always with me, though your face may fade as the memories grow old. But your voice will lie inside, wrapping me up in its sweet, gentle melody, protecting me from harm till the night is done. May I see you, up above, when the angels are restored, the harps playing symphonies, the clouds are sparkling gaily. Our lives may be over, but an eternity of laughter? Now that has just begun.